Okay, hi everybody. For these fingerless gloves, you need a crochet hook 4.25 millimeters and worsted weight yarn number four. If you have a small or regular size hand, you can start with 26 chains like this. But if you have larger hands, you can work 28 or 30 chains. Okay, a slip stitch in the first chain to form a ring for the first round, work chain 3 and double crochet stitch on each chain across. In this case you're gonna get 26 double crochet stitches. I just finished this first round, work a slip stitch on the top of the third chain from the beginning, work chain 3 for the second round, this is our first stitch. On the second stitch work a front pause double crochet stitch. Then work a back pause double crochet stitch. One more time, a front pass double crochet stitch. And then another back pause double crochet stitch. So you want to repeat the pattern. This is low motion of the front pass double crochet stitch. On the back, yarn over and start your hook from the, from the back, yarn over, pull through loops and pull through all the loops on hook. So repeat these steps to complete your round. You're gonna get 26 stitches. The total is, is 26 stitches. Slip stitch on top of the third chain from the beginning. And repeat the same thing for the next rounds. You're gonna work six rounds in the same way. So from past, from previous, from past, and back pause on the back pause from previous round. Here we. I just finish. I just finished my six rounds. Slip stitch on the third chain from the beginning. The following rounds will be different. Work chain three. Skip your first front pass, double crochet stitch. And on the second front pass, on the top, of the second front pass double crochet stitch work chain two like like chain two pull through all your loops on hook chain one and this in the next front pass work one more time chain two and pull through all, all your hooks all your loops on hook and start your hook in the next front pause work the chains 
chain one, insert your hook in the next, chain one, two, yarn over and pull through all the loops on hook and chain one again. So work like that. You have to work only on the top all of all your front pass double crochet stitches. You're gonna get 14 stitches. I have 13 here. We need one more. Okay, this is the last one. Okay, we will know we will not work in closing our rounds but working a spiral. So this is our next round. Chain two and pull through all loops on hook. Chain one. chain two and yarn over and pull through all loops and hook chain one again and keep repeating the pattern to complete the round you can mark your stitch for figure eight where where is your beginning Okay, we are finishing this round. After chain one, we're gonna start our sec where our next round in here. So chain one and pull through all your loops and hook. Chain one and continue working like that. To complete your round, one more time, chain two, yarn over and pull through all your loops and hook, chain one, and repeat the steps for the next stitches across. Remember, we are working in spiral. Chain one. This is your first stitch for your next round. One more time, chain one, chain two, one, two, and pull through. Repeat the potter to complete your round. Remember, we are working in spiral, so this is the marker stitch work there and work and your next stitches all across to complete your round Okay, after 10 rounds, work chain 3 for make a space, to make a space for your thumb. So skip this 
stitches and work on the next stitch. So here you got your hole for your thumb, chain one, and work the same stitch and all stitches across to complete your round. For the next round, working in the hole from previous round, you're gonna work two stitches there. This is one and two. Continue in the next. Chain one, insert your hook in the next stitch, chain one, two, pull through all your loops and hook and chain one. And repeat this kind of stitches to complete your round. Okay, we are finishing these gloves. This is our last stitch. Work on chain two for the end. Skip your next stitch and slip a stitch in the next stitch. Okay, we done. Just fast enough and wave the ends. Make the other one for your second hand and enjoy it. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Have a nice day or night. Bye bye. God bless you.